Whether you're washing dishes or putting on goggles at the pool, you are coming into contact with rubber. Did you know that this everyday material could also save your life during an earthquake? Engineers have used rubber in buildings for decades, but it took some time before they realized that it could help save lives in earthquake-prone areas. This versatile material is stiff enough to support a building, but pliant enough to deflect the energy of an earthquake. Rubber is not just effective, it's also inexpensive. Surprisingly, this technology was not immediately used everywhere. As catastrophic earthquakes continued to take the lives of thousands, the International Organization for Standardization, Committee ISO TC45, dedicated to making rubber standards, turned to rubber bearings. When used in the structure of a building, rubber bearings deflect an earthquake's destructive energy. The building will still move, but will not collapse. By developing standards for rubber bearings, ISO TC45 aims to encourage their use and save lives. These standards allow manufacturers and users to ensure the material and products are safe and effective. And these are just some among many other rubber standards developed by ISO TC45 that ensure performance and safety, reduce environmental impact, and enable the recycling and sustainability of rubber products all around us. From rubber boots to high-speed trains to billions and billions of balloons.